Good morning, I'm Brother Puch. Welcome to Cooking with Bro. My name is Prince. My name is Alika. My name is Ado. And I'm also Prince. Today, uh, the four of them will be assisting me in preparing my favorite food. Whenever I'm stressed, this is what I do, okay, or from work. Today, we're going to prepare a vegetarian lasagna. Bro, how do you prepare a lasagna? Actually, there, were four, there are four preparations. The first is, you're going to prepare the vegetables. Second, you're going to prepare the tomato sauce. And then the third is, you're going to prepare the white sauce. Those are white vegetables. One, I'm trying to lose weight. Okay. Second, and this is healthy and it's good for us. Okay, so because this morning, we're going to talk about what will make us happy. Here are ingredients. You know, do you know what is this? Zucchini. Zucchini. That's not cucumber. Okay, that's zucchini. What about this one? Celery. Celery. What about this? Mushroom. This one. Annika, what is this? Onions. And my favorite is tomato. Tomatoes. How do I pronounce this? Tomatis. Tomatis, tomato, tomato. It's the same, but this is my favorite. It's good for the heart. The first thing that we're going to do is saute the vegetables using butter so, so that it will be uh, prepared well. This one will go first, zucchini. What I do is uh, put it first there and then give it at least uh, five minutes so that it will be tender. And it's not also good to cook it uh, too much because it, or it raw because it doesn't it doesn't taste good, especially for kids like you. Do you eat vegetables? Yes, sometimes. Uh, sometimes. sometimes. That's why today I'm going to prepare something like vegetables so that you will be happy. All of us will be happy. And healthy, yours, alright. And then, after 5 minutes, I'm going to put in all the other ingredients. Okay. And afterwards, to, to taste, to put to taste, we'll add salt and pepper. It's a little bit of everything. Mm -hmm. Once everything is ready, this is how it should look like. Okay? This is the filling. Everything is there. So how do you find it? Do you find it exciting? Do you find it good? So, you have to try this. Okay, Prince. Okay. Annika. Love and Prince. Okay. You should try this. Okay. Go first. Okay. Go. No, it's all. Really, huh? What about your Mm-hmm. They're not saying anything. Maybe they don't like this. Okay, really? That's good. Mm -hmm. Just like what? Vegetable, right? <laughs> so, that's it. Afterwards, we will set this aside because we're going to move to the next next preparation, which is the white sauce. Now, for the second preparation, for the white sauce, first we'll start with the butter. Okay, just a little bit of it, so that it doesn't be too much. Afterwards, put the what is this? Flour. Flour. Okay. And then. As they say in Zubair, make halo. Tama ba ba? Is that how you say it in Zubair? Yes. Why do you like sauce, brother? It's not a lasagna without it. That's one. 
it's just like me as a brother. Without the schools, there will be no LaSalle brothers. Because that's the first mission of the brothers, and that is to educate Young students boys. like you. Okay. So afterwards, we're going to mix the milk. Okay. The secret to this is we have to pour it slowly. Stir it. Ready. You can you can put salt or pepper just to add some taste. Even add cheese to make it more desired. Okay. Okay. Adult, you wanna try putting in some cheese? Okay. No, no, not really. Just a little bit. Of no, no, you can use your hands. You wash your hands anyway. Okay. What does he want to put in? No, not tomato. <laughs> Salt. Yes. Anika. Okay. What does he want to put in? Pepper. Pepper. Wanna try? Rinse. For our last preparation, it's the tomato sauce. We'll start it with butter. There's an option actually, you can use olive oil or canola oil so that it will be healthy, not the oil of pork or what, okay? So for, for this morning, we'll use butter. So take it and afterwards, you mix, you pour in the, what do you call this? Onion. Onion. Okay, you can either do it in batch or actually do it in batch. So that you know the the taste, the aroma will be preserved, and it will be better that way. And afterwards, pour in the what is this? My favorite kamatis. This is good for me, especially for my heart. Okay. Leave it there for five minutes again. Then pour in all the other herbs and spices. Okay. Five. Not to make. This one is thyme. Okay. Smell. No? It's interesting, right? Smells like what? Pizza. This pizza is just good. Because I'm going to just like this one. Just don't sneeze. Can I taste it? No. And then sugar and oregano okay. put it in put all in and then leave it again for three minutes Just allow it to simmer with uh, then you pour at least one cup of water and then simmer it allow it to simmer for two to three minutes afterwards once it's ready na, you can pour it in first with tomato paste I think it's a little bit too big, so I'm not going to eat the sauce. First, this has to go good. Okay. Why? Uh, to put on the flavor. The last part is the sauce, the tomato sauce. And then you can add cheese if you want. 
-hmm. That's it. That's it for the tomato sauce. Mm -hmm. And then you can add sugar or milk, actually. If you, you can add more if you want to. If you want to make it sweet, you can, you can even make it sour. So it's up to, this is where actually the real flavor of the comes in. So you can adjust it. If you want the sweeter side, you can have it on the sour side. Bro, why did you choose to be a brother? Well, the first brother that I came to do was Brother Dennis. He was my grade 5 teacher and the moment I saw him in class, I was attracted to what, what he was wearing, the white robe. Because I'm wearing the black robe now. And then from, the, from that time on, I was telling myself, someday I'll be like him. Okay, so after 16 years of praying about it, I became good. Mm -hmm. Just like the spices here, of course. It's like my story. I went through different challenges in life before I became a brother, actually. Since you're only teaching my class, right? 7G? Yes, I'm teaching 7G for this? two months. Hmm? What do you think about this? At first, I thought you were a challenge. Uh, teaching for me is a walk in the park experience, but after two months, I realized that you were so loving, you were so caring, you were so interesting. I know I see. Sometimes, yes. yes. <laughs> As I did all the time. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Alright. Brother, yes. do you like my class? Do you like my class? 6A? Well, I had, I had a good time with you guys when we went out for an outreach in the House of Hope, right? Uh, it wasn't, it was for me the first time that I went out to the things in two days. So I really had a good time. Oh, bro, I'm sorry, but isn't it boring to be a brother? I'm just. Good question. They're just like these spices, the reason why we put in the spices to add more flavor, because sometimes the life of the brother becomes actually more important. But, that's what I thought for the last three years. But you know what? After a while, I realized there's a lot of things that you need to know about the brothers. A lot of exciting things, actually. Okay. Just like the spices. Means I may not make it at any time. So be careful. You know, everything is there. And I realized in the end that actually the brothers' life is exciting, fun, and I'm happy to be a brother. So Prince, you want to be a brother? Uh, maybe. Well, because my experience with a brother, Brother Sessi, he kind of inspired me, gave me to become a brother because he taught me a lot of lessons in life. Like, sometimes when you fail, you just have to strive harder. And maybe. Maybe. But, but my true dream is to become a basketball player like my dad. Well, you can be a basketball player brother at the same time, right? Is it what about you? You want to be a brother? I don't know. <laughs> you don't know yet because you're still raising your anyway. Actually, Adolf Geiser actually wants to be a brother someday, right? Oh, no. He did not tell me. <laughs> I don't. Yeah. Well, you're still young to consider. Yeah. I mean, you still have a lot of time to think about it, right, Adolf? Yeah. But Brother Dennis thought you can become a brother. What do you think? <laughs> well, Anika, just in case you're interested, we have the Lasal Sisters as well. Okay? Uh, we have it in uh, Lasal Antipolo right now. There are about five sisters there. They are called the Guadalapanas de Lasal. It's a Mexican Lasalian congregation, actually. Just like the brothers, they also serve in school. Probably not because I think about it. I still busy here with the family stuff. If that makes you happy, it's alright. The point is, what the brothers offer is you have a life of okay, a good life, and then what is more important is you discover what makes you happy in life, and that will be your vocation. Okay? Okay, now we have already prepared three things, right? The first one was what? The vegetables. the vegetables, second was the white, white sauce. sauce, and the third was the tomato sauce. Now we're going to do the lasagna now. Okay. The first thing that you're going to do is to put in the tomato sauce. Okay. What you're going to do is just put a little and then spread it. Okay. Why don't you try it? Get, get some tomato sauce, put it inside and spread it. Spread it evenly. Okay. More. Spread it. Yep. 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 Spread it. Ooh. 
Perfect. Third eye, you put in the white sauce. And then this one. What you're going to do is this. You put the noodles inside in the layers, okay? So rinse what you do. You put you get one and put it. Put one more. Afterwards, you can put now the vegetable. Anika, you can put in the vegetable. Just a little bit more. Okay? After this, the same process, okay? You put in the tomato sauce, the white sauce, then the noodles, okay? you can you can opt to put the cheese also if you want to be more cheesy. Mm -hmm. And then same process. And once you're done, you put in the parmesan cheese on top, spread it, mm -hmm. spread it. And from there we can bake it already. Mm -hmm. You can eat it. You can eat it, yes. Mm -hmm. Right? Are you excited? Yes. 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 I had fun doing this. It looks good. Really? Are you excited? Yeah. Yep. Yes. What would you add? Uh, we have a learning alternative to uh, this system of the version. Wow. <laughs> That's all you had to say. Wow. Yeah. Right. Wow. <laughs> okay. So we'll prepare now the lasagna. Bake it and we need it. Okay guys, here's our lasagna. Why don't you try it? Yeah, right. Let's try it. 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 What about you, sir? Fish. Well done. Well done. Yeah. What about you? So good. Yeah, okay. Let's enjoy. Yes. It tastes more good. Yeah. Yeah. It tastes more good than the Milo. No. Pasta is good. Alright. So, how's, how's the lasagna? Well, you I enjoyed it, right? I finished it, yeah, it's good. Are you happy? Yeah. 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 Prince, yeah. I think Prince is so happy because he finished it already. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah. So why why I want you to taste it? Because this is what I'm passionate about. Okay. I'm happy cooking. Okay, I'm happy cooking lasagna and I'm yeah. happy about about how you how you react to this. And then it's also about me trying to be healthy. Because I'm trying to lose weight. I've lost 
11 pounds here in the music. Wow. And I used to be like him when I was in grade 5 also. So let's yeah. see his wow. future. <laughs> so, and then, uh, this is also my way of giving thanks to the Nasas and Chai Sobele for the wonderful two months that I was here, especially in your class. Yeah. And, uh, I'm going to miss you guys. I'm so Did you see the video already? So, okay, so. Huh? Yes, you? I saw the video. Thank you for the surprise. Okay. So, I think you know about it. <laughs> so okay. So to end our our show, Cooking with Bro, thank you so much for joining me. Thank you guys for joining us as well, Sukini. And then as we as we end our our gathering here this morning, okay, join me as we say, Animo Lasagna. lasagna!